In the United States, several states have struggled with poverty for years. Despite various initiatives, economic development programs, and government support, some states still face significant challenges in reducing poverty levels. In this video, we will be highlighting the 15 poorest states in the US in 2023 based on the latest statistics. Before we dive into the details, we want to extend a warm welcome to all our viewers. Thank you for joining us on the insightful journey. If you find the video valuable and informative, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss an update. We appreciate your support. Number 15, Florida. With a poverty rate of $13.87, which is slightly lower than the national average of 15.74%. This makes it difficult for people to earn enough money to meet their basic needs. Florida has the 18th lowest high school graduation rate in the country and only 28% of adults have a bachelor's degree. African Americans and Hispanic people are disproportionately likely to live in poverty in Florida. This is due to a variety of factors including, a lack of access to opportunities and systemic racism. Number 14, Arizona. With a poverty rate of 12.8%, Arizona faces significant poverty challenges. The state's struggles can be attributed to factors such as low wages, limited job opportunities, and disparities in education and healthcare. The average hourly wage in Arizona is $13.75, which is significantly lower than the national average of $15.74. North Carolina has the 16th lowest high school graduation rate in the country, and only 28% of adults have a bachelor's degree. This lack of education and skills makes it difficult for people to find good-paying jobs. Arizona is a large state, and many people live in rural areas. This can make it difficult to access jobs, education, and healthcare. Number 13, North Carolina. North Carolina ranks 13th among the poorest states in the U.S., with a poverty rate of 12.9%. The state's poverty struggles are influenced by factors such as income inequality, limited access to affordable housing and healthcare, and disparities in education. The average hourly wage in North Carolina is $15.03, which is significantly lower than the national average of $15.74. North Carolina has the 15th lowest high school graduation rate in the country, and only 28% of adults have a bachelor's degree. The unemployment rate in North Carolina is 6.2%, which is higher than the national average of 3.6%. This means that there are fewer jobs available, which makes it even harder for people to earn a living. Number 12, Texas. Texas, despite its size and economic diversity, faces persistent poverty issues, with a poverty rate of 13.4%. Factors such as income inequality, limited social safety nets, and disparities in educational attainment contribute to the state's poverty challenges. The average hourly wage in Texas is $13.73, which is significantly lower than the national average of $15.74. Texas has the 15th lowest high school graduation rate in the country, and only 28% of adults have a bachelor's degree. The unemployment rate in Texas is 4.1%, which is higher than the national average of 3.6%. Number 11, Tennessee. With a poverty rate of 13.6%, Tennessee holds the 11th position among the poorest states in the U.S. The state's poverty challenges can be attributed to factors such as income inequality, limited access to quality education and healthcare, and a high percentage of low-wage jobs. Initiatives aimed at reducing poverty and promoting economic growth are crucial for the state's progress. The average hourly wage in Tennessee is $13.69, which is significantly lower than the national average of $15.74. The unemployment rate in Tennessee is 4.3%, which is higher than the national average of 3.6%. Number 10, South Carolina. South Carolina ranks 10th among the poorest states in the USA, with a poverty rate of 13.8%. The state faces challenges related to low wages, limited job opportunities, and disparities in education and healthcare. Efforts to address poverty and improve economic conditions are essential for the well-being of South Carolinians. The average hourly wage in South Carolina is $13.67, which is significantly lower than the national average of $15.74. The unemployment rate in South Carolina is 4.4%, which is higher than the national average of 3.6%. Number 9, Georgia. 
Georgia holds the ninth position among the poorest states in America, with a poverty rate of 14%. The state's poverty struggles are influenced by factors such as income inequality, limited access to quality education and healthcare, and a high percentage of low-wage jobs. Efforts to address these issues are ongoing, but poverty remains a pressing concern in the Peach State. The average hourly wage in Georgia is $13.71, which is significantly lower than the national average of $15.74. This makes it difficult for people. The unemployment rate in Georgia is 4.6%, which is higher than the national average of 3.6%. Number 8, Oklahoma. Oklahoma ranks 8th among the poorest states in the U.S., with a poverty rate of 14.3%. The state's economy is heavily dependent on industries such as energy, agriculture, and manufacturing, which can be subject to economic fluctuations. Income inequality, educational disparities, and limited access to affordable health care contribute to the state's poverty challenges. The average hourly wage in Oklahoma is $13.54, which is significantly lower than the national average of $15.74. The unemployment rate in Oklahoma is 4.7%, which is higher than the national average of 3.6%. Number 7, Kentucky. Kentucky shares the seventh position for poorest states, also having a poverty rate of 14.9%. The state faces persistent poverty issues due to factors such as limited job opportunities, low educational attainment levels, and healthcare disparities. Addressing these challenges is crucial to improving the well-being of Kentuckians and fostering sustainable economic growth. The unemployment rate in Kentucky is 4.9%, which is higher than the national average of 3.6%. This means that there are fewer jobs available, which makes it even harder for people to earn a living. Number 6, Alabama. Alabama ranks sixth among the poorest states in America, with a poverty rate of 14.9%. The state's poverty issues stem from a combination of factors, including limited economic opportunities, low wages, and educational disparities. Efforts are being made to improve economic conditions and reduce poverty, but Alabama still faces significant challenges in this regard. The average hourly wage in Alabama is $13.57, which is significantly lower than the national average of $15.74. The unemployment rate in Alabama is 5%, which is higher than the national average of 3.6%. Alabama is a rural state, and many people live in isolated areas. This can make it difficult to access jobs, education, and healthcare. Number 5, Arkansas. Arkansas has the fifth poorest state in the U.S., with a poverty rate of 15.2%. The average hourly wage in Arkansas is $13.62 which is significantly lower than the national average of $15.74. Arkansas has the seventh lowest high school graduation rate in the country, and only 26% of adults have a bachelor's degree. The unemployment rate in Arkansas is 5.1%, which is higher than the national average of 3.6%. Arkansas is a rural state, and many people live in isolated areas. This can make it difficult to access jobs, education, and health care. Number 4, West Virginia. With a poverty rate of 15.8%, West Virginia ranks as the fourth poorest state in America. The state's economy has historically relied heavily on coal mining, which has faced a significant decline in recent years. This, coupled with factors such as limited job opportunities, low wages, and high rates of opioid addiction, has contributed to the state's persistent poverty issues. West Virginia has the third lowest high school graduation rate in the country, and only 25% of adults have a bachelor's degree. The unemployment rate in West Virginia is 5%, which is higher than the national average of 3.6%. The average hourly wage in West Virginia is $13.46, which is significantly lower than the national average of $15.74. Number 3, New Mexico. New Mexico is the third poorest state in the USA, with a poverty rate of 16.8%. The state's poverty struggles can be attributed to factors such as a large rural population, limited economic diversification, and low educational attainment levels. Efforts are being made to address these issues and stimulate economic growth, but poverty remains a significant challenge in the land of enchantment. The median household income in New Mexico is $50,754, which is below the national average. 
the average hourly wage in New Mexico is $13.76, which is significantly lower than the national average of $15.74. This makes it difficult for people to earn enough money to meet their basic needs. New Mexico has the fourth lowest high school graduation rate in the country, and only 24% of adults have a bachelor's degree. Number 2, Louisiana. Louisiana ranks as the second poorest state in the U.S., with a poverty rate of 17.8%. The state's economy heavily relies on industries such as energy, tourism, and agriculture, which can be subject to volatility. Additionally, Louisiana faces challenges related to education, healthcare access, and income inequality, contributing to its high poverty levels. The unemployment rate in Louisiana is 4.5%, which is higher than the national average of 3.6%. This means that there are fewer jobs available, which makes it even harder for people to earn a living. The average hourly wage in Louisiana is $13.50, which is significantly lower than the national average of $15.74. This makes it difficult for people to earn enough money to meet their basic needs. Louisiana has the fifth lowest high school graduation rate in the country, and only 23% of adults have a bachelor's degree. Number 1, Mississippi. Mississippi is the poorest state in the U.S., with a poverty rate of 18.7%. Despite the state's rich history, cultural heritage, and abundance of natural resources, poverty remains a pervasive issue. The state's high poverty rate is attributed to various factors, including a lack of well-paying jobs, inadequate access to education and healthcare, and a low minimum wage. The average hourly wage in Mississippi is $13.17, which is significantly lower than the national average of $15.74. Additionally, the state's history of racial discrimination has contributed to systemic inequalities that perpetuate poverty. Although efforts have been made to address the issue, poverty remains a significant challenge in the state of Mississippi. Mississippi has the lowest high school graduation rate in the country, and only 20% of adults have a bachelor's degree. And this makes it difficult for people to find good-paying jobs. Mississippi is a rural state, and many people live in isolated areas. This can make it difficult to access jobs, education, and healthcare. As we conclude our discussion on the 15 poorest states in the U.S., it is important to remember that poverty is a complex issue with no easy fix, however, by raising awareness and supporting initiatives that address education, employment, and economic development, we can make a difference. If you found this video informative and thought-provoking, please share it with your friends and family. Thank you for being part of our community. Don't forget to leave a comment down below.